Coach Dresser, talk about the 2008-2009 direction of the Hokies and who you're expecting big things out of. Well, this is a youth movement here right now because right now on our squad, I think with the exception of one individual, everybody's a third year sophomore, redshirt sophomore or younger and predominantly freshmen and sophomores. And obviously the, the situation we inherited as, as a coaching staff kind of forced our hand in that direction. And uh, But it's been, you know, I, I really think we're kind of over the storm now. The first two years were tough. I mean, really tough. Um, but, you know, there, there's light at the end of the tunnel. We're excited about we're excited about the future just as we were the first day we all got hired. You know, I got a great staff and Tony and Nate and getting ready to hire another position here. But, you know, we're probably, right now on paper, if you look at us, we're probably going to start everybody as a freshman and sophomore. Um, and that's exciting from a coaching standpoint, but from an you know, experience standpoint, we're going to lose some matches this year just because of experience. You know, we got some really good talent. I'm actually, and I know the rest of the coaching staff, I'm actually really excited about all 10 weights. Um, and, you know, I can't say I was excited about 10 weights the last two years. So I'm excited about 10 weights, all 10 weights. Uh, you know, you can go up and down the line. We got some good freshmen, Garnett. Lavorio, Dong, Yates, you know, they're, they're guys that are you know big recruit guys. Uh, I don't want to leave anybody out because I'll probably make my guys mad, but if I didn't mention them, they better get to work. Um, uh, you know, we've got some guys in their second year here. We had a transfer in uh, from Ohio State, Will Livingston. It's a Jersey boy that's tough as nails. We're excited about him. You know, then we got some guys that have been in this program for a year. Um, Diaz, uh, Trongone. Uh, Spellman, Ryan, DJ Bruce, Maroney, you know, we're excited about those guys. Some of our older guys, you know, Epperly won the ACC's last year, got outstanding wrestler. Very talented, needs to get tougher, but very talented. So, you know, we're kind of in the same boat across the board at all 10 weights. We just need experience and we need to learn how to fight. We need to learn how to win big matches. You got any scoop for me on who that assistant's going to be? Uh, anybody's <laughs> listening. Anybody's listening. We're, we're working hard. You know, we could have hired somebody right away in August or September, but we didn't. We want to get the right guy in here, and I think we get you know the right person in here that, that uh, we've got a good position with a lot of dough, so we're going to go after some, some guys here soon. Okay, you're an Iowa guy. You got two Edinburgh guys. Yes. Is there going to be another Edinburgh guy? Or can't you tell I me? Know, can't you... I don't think there's any more good Edinburgh guys out there. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I don't coach. know. I don't know who we're going to get. We're, we'll see. Is there uh, anything else you want people to know about uh, Virginia Tech wrestling this year? No, we're just young. You know, we, there's not much to, uh, to brag about yet. we got to do it on the mat. So uh, I can say that we're going to be good, but until we show we're good, we're not good. All right, Coach. That's enough for me. Thanks. That's right.